yo, yo, what up, YouTube? Yax is your boy Daddy Easy here, iPod Jeopardy Hacker, otherwise known as only USB Tomax. And some of you may know me as Easy, like I always say, to the black to the blue, my avatar on my YouTube channel. Yeah, buddy. So you can see in front of me, I am playing Metal Gear Solid 5 The Phantom Pain. And you can see I'm using a secret character, it is Snake. That's right. So, be able to get this character, only thing you need to do is upload the um save data that you have from playing metal Gears, metal gear solid ground zeros um if you play the deja vu mission um that's the character right there you need uh once you upload it you'll be able to get this suit and stuff like that and be able to play it just upload it to metal gear solid phantom pain and he will be a playable character that you'll be able to play as you can see right here on the screen but let's get to my review and as you can see on the screen i do have a large gameplay on it now where I'm at right now on the game um I progressed a lot uh I've spent a lot of money on here what I mean by money I'm not talking about actual physical money I'm talking about in-game currency that purchasing guns upgrading guns upgrading my chopper um upgrading my mother base uh doing everything else I've spent so much time on this game now is the game fun the game is fucking addictive. Now, when I first turned it on and started playing it, now I got the game actually a little bit earlier. Um, I've put up a video before, but um, when I put up the video before of the unboxing and all that crap like that, um, for some reason I kept getting a copyright uh, uh, claim from somebody named Murphy Bean, whatever his damn Ben, whatever his name is. Many people's been getting it, so I actually kept taking down the video so I kept uploading it. Uh, YouTube for some reason YouTube start working whatever maybe whatever but every time I put up the video of it I was not able to play it like the way I want to now I've got it for my PC uh, which is still downloading on uh, my internet cut off for some reason I don't know why but it was probably a, it was a down thing for my internet so that cut off so I was having a hard time actually trying to finish downloading my PC version got it for the PS4 everything above the graphics on here is lovely the PS4, PS4 version graphics is crazy. 1080p, 6 frames per second. Love the game. Um, Xbox One, um, I'm still getting that. Even though it's in 900p, 600, it looks better on the PS4. If y'all want to know, PS4 version is better. If you want more graphical enhance, get it on the PC if you want it more better. But PS4 version looks just like almost as the um, PC version, just a little bit more textures and stuff. Out of all the game is fun. You have a lot to do. It's a lot of side missions. I actually found myself doing a lot of side missions. Because the side missions is actually you can go in running gun, ex oh, you know, extract them, get in, come back out, and you get the extra points and stuff. Now, what you just see me is just actually um, take one of the people and carry them to my balloon. Every time you use that balloon thing to transport somebody, it does take away currency from you. Meaning you lose money, you lose 300 um, currency points when you actually do that every time. So don't always do that. I found myself doing that a lot just so I can clear the area without hiding bodies. So I can get in and location without having to hide bodies and do the extra stuff just to get in and to get out. Um, if you play Ground Zeroes, you notice there's a lot of similarity towards it. There's a lot of things. Um, you also get a bionic arm. Uh, and this one, as you see right here, I just use them. As you can see, the red means currency that I just lost, all that. I called in a supply drop right here, just so I can restack my um, suppressor, my ammunition. Uh, that's one thing I do, like when you run out of uh, ammunition and stuff, you can ask for supply drops. Now, one thing that I do love on this game, which they took this out of a lot of games like Mercenary, Mercenary uh, what is it, Mercenary 2, uh just cuz on um, games like that and is able to uh allow to call air support and air strikes so like the helicopter come in uh blow up the whole location or you can actually uh, a airdrop which basically they take the airdrop um you pick a location then you just see bombs come flying out of the sky and all that good shit I, you can also upgrade it so you can get like a um, helicopter thing that you throw like a flare. I'm, not, I'm sorry, not flare. Um, a smoke thing on the ground and a chopper come in and start um, shooting everything up. I never got a chance to use it yet. Um, it does use up currency when you do that. I just try not to use it if I don't have to. Um, 
I don't know if that specifically use up currency because I haven't used it yet. I do have it in my inventory, but I just never used it. Um, I never really had to use it, but on like one time when I called in an airstrike. Um, airstrike come in handy when you want to take out a specific location and also infiltrate the um, area very quick so you can run in, distract them by the airstrike, run into the um, different sides. One thing that I do like, they do give you the option to land in different positions on it so you can infiltrate the um, locations very quick like that. I do like that. That's a good feature. Um, I like the fact that you can upgrade weapons on the go. Uh, as I'm sitting here, I can upgrade a weapon, have it sent to me by supply drop, and keep on. That's one of the good things that I do like about this game. It's non-stop action. Always going. There was an airstrike right there. Um, I don't know if I caught that airstrike in or if that airstrike automatically happened right there. I don't remember exactly what I did, but yeah. Um, the ability to keep on doing things, keep running, keep playing like that. Now, Grand Theft Auto have a big problem now because this game right here is very, very addictive. So, um, only thing that I don't like about this game, which is very, very small, is the option of not being able to fly any vehicles that's the only problem i have but you can get dogs um horses vehicles whatever the sky's the limit on here and it's a lot of fun um as you can see right here i'm trying to get headshots to take this guy down but this is coming up towards the end of my review of this video i give this game straight 10 out of 10 game of the year best game ever so it's your boy daddy easy here ipod drop break hacker only using tomahawks so remember live it love it game it peace and deuces and stay tuned for the rest of my gameplay that i have coming up of some other missions that i have now so i will catch you guys later peace and deuces one